This is Janae, the Mystical Medic, doing an elemental walk through the full moon lunar eclipse in Taurus and the new moon solar eclipse in Sagittarius. Let's see. What did the full moon lunar eclipse bring you, Scorpio? It's your opposite sign. It brought you some truth. All right, karma. What truths have you accepted, digested, and released? How are you benefiting from the release of those things in your body? Sun and Libra energy, harmony. Truth in harmony. And a new direction. Reevaluate your success. All right. So is this dietary stuff? Is it emotional digestion? Is it digesting truths from your ego? And how much of it do you decide to analyze before you let it go? What are you accepting for yourself, Scorpio? You're in your head because you don't trust your gut. This is a new sort of desire that you're being initiated into. And you're going to have to stay out of your head because I know you like to be analytical and I know... Um, sometimes your own depth of emotion can terrify you, especially when you consider sharing them with someone else. And then at other times you're quick to be impulsive and share with the wrong person. You're, I totally understand if you're afraid of sharing with the wrong person. Three, four, five on the clock as I said that. So take baby steps. Quit biting off more than you chew or more than you're able to chew. How are you re-establishing the harmony from inside yourself All right aquarius energy of letting go detaching emotionally and death death and rebirth because the wounded warrior is just exhausted and you no longer want to sit in this eight of swords energy and so are you going to keep with the same crowds that leave you here what is this exactly yeah there's a lot of things that will be revealed to you at the solar eclipse so just take one thing at a time. That's what I've got you for you right now, Scorpio. I will talk to you soon. Take care.